But when it came to heroics by Japanese players, no one did it better than Ichiro. What makes him unbelievable? He has the feet of a cat. A consistently lethal bat. And a glove of gold. He's a special player and it seemed like a, like a natural fit for us. We, he's, just, he's just a very exciting ball player. We're glad to have him with us. But a rough spring training in 2001 had some folks wondering if he could make the jump to the major leagues. He really didn't hit that well in spring. He looked like he was overmatched by a lot of the pitchers, and, and, and they weren't even number one pitchers. And the shoulders that swung at their pitches carried a lot of weight. This is a, a big adjustment for him and, and a lot of pressure. And the eyes of an entire nation are focused on each year old. There are some nuances uh, that are different uh, from the Japanese game to the American game. And coming over here, facing guys that he's never seen, never heard of. I think what we need to do is, is not place too much attention or put too much focus. And I know that's hard to do. But at the same time, let the guy play. And oh, did he play once the season got underway. What a start for Ichiro. He's something. And let's watch him fly. My, oh, my, Ichiro, you are just too much. Ichiro had hitting streaks of 15, 21, and 23 games. He hit in 39 of his first 41. After just one month, his teammates were believers. Ichiro is... Uh... It's been amazing. It's very rare to see a player that young and, and uh, first year in the league to be able to do what he's done. Ichiro was becoming a hero in two countries. In the U.S., Ichiro mania was heating up. And the pride of a nation was everywhere in Japan. Japan rejoiced when, for the first time in Major League history, a Japanese pitcher faced a Japanese hitter. It was Ichiro versus Shigatoshi Hasegawa. Ichiro sends a ground ball towards shortstop, and there is no way in the world he is going to throw him out. Ichiro had two hits against Hasegawa, but the big matchup was still to come. Hideo Nomo versus Ichiro. The confrontation everyone in Japan had been waiting for. This game is being televised live in Japan. They are expecting their largest audience in their history. With Nomo now pitching for Boston, Ichiro wouldn't be the one doing the hitting. Hit him in the back. Ichiro hit by Hideo Nomo. And Ichiro's in some pain. One week later, it was Ichiro who did the hitting as he gained revenge on his countrymen in the second confrontation with two base hits and a run batted in. With the pressure of the early season behind him, Ichiro began to soar in the Seattle spotlight. Ichiro's relentless bat and quick feet consistently put him in scoring position. The fact that Seattle was running away from everyone else in the Western Division of the American League could be directly traced to the man at the top. Ichiro has been a, as good a leadoff hitter as there is in baseball. I don't know of a way to get this guy out. He hits routine ground balls at shortstop and, and third base, and he beats him out. My, oh, my! Can that little guy fly? He's our table setter. I mean, when he beats the ball on the ground, then he gets a base hit. And then he steals second, then he steals third, and he's key for us. But Ichiro's speed didn't just help Seattle score runs, it also prevented them. But when you combined his quickness with his glove, Ichiro's defense was an awesome sight to see. My, oh my! What an 
right fielder he is. That may be the best catch I've seen all season long. There were many great catches in 2001, but there will only ever be one throw. Terrence Long tried to go from first to third. He was playing fairly deep in right field. So heading to third base is Long the throw to third base. And it got him nailed at third base on a tremendous throw by Ichiro. My, oh my, Ichiro. I've been broadcasting Major League Baseball a long, long time, and I've seen some great throws. But this may have been the greatest throw I've ever seen. Ichiro throws something out of Star Wars down there. The force really was with Ichiro in 2001. Almost overnight, he earned the respect of teammates and opponents alike. Just watching what he does, his knowledge of the game is just unbelievable. He's a great player. He's one of the top players in in the world. He was there and he is here. He's certainly a, uh, an integral part of all of that situation happening in Seattle. And, and it's great for Seattle, it's great for baseball. Ichiro's amazing season earned him both Rookie of the Year and Most Valuable Player awards. And his rookie year was the perfect follow-up to teammate